Okay, so today we're going to start talking about how to add numbers together. Now, there are a couple of different ways in which you can do this, but one of the ways I want to look at first is by what they call partitioning, or breaking the numbers down into its component parts. So, for instance, if you have a number which is 139, that means 9 units, 3 tens, and 100. And what you can do is say, well, actually, that is made up of 100 and then 30 and then 9. If you add that little lot together you get 139 and that's how we break up the numbers. So we can use that fact then to be able to add two numbers together. So let's say that we're going to add 139 plus 43 which also has three units and four tens. Now the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to say well that first number is actually 130 and this number here is 40 and what I've done here is I've added 100 and 3 tens added to 4 tens and that will give me 170 now I need to add the two units together so 9 add 3 is 12 so I'm going to put that there add those two together and my answer is 182. So what I've done is I've broken it down into its component parts and used that to add the two numbers together. Um, it is a way of working that works fairly well um, and it's no problem at all with using this sort of method to calculate how to add two numbers together. If you look at some of the other videos I will talk about a more formal method as well.